weekend. Summer in Indiana is packed with fun festivals and fairs. Harlan Days is up next on the roster and kicks off next week. Joining me this morning to give us a scoop is Kevin Mullet. Kevin, good morning. How are good you? Good morning. I'm well. Perfect. Glad to hear that. Of course, this is an annual festival, so just in case people don't know about it, what is it all about? Well, Harlan Days is a fair for family just to come out and have fun. We have fair food. Uh, the theme this year is Welcome Back. Uh, obviously, last year we didn't get to do it. Uh, but we just want people to come out and enjoy all of the festivities that we have going on. And this is a very family-friendly festival, not only for the entertainment, but for your pocketbook, too. Yeah, well, it's free to come on out and enjoy. We have live entertainment at 7 o'clock every evening. Uh, that could be, uh, you could be watching some of the sports. We have basketball. We have cornhole tournaments. We have uh, softball is really big out in our area. But then we also have live music that happens each evening. And we have a big event each of the three evenings, and, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And those are all happening in three main rings you talked yeah, about. Yeah, so we have, we have an arena event that happens, and uh, that's a, a $5 fee for that. So those are special events, but there's plenty to do for free. We have uh, horse racing on Thursday. We have drag racing on dirt oh, on wow. Uh, uh, Friday, and we have the Monster Truck and Pyro Show. <laughs> you that have we to have do the voice. You got to do the voice. <laughs> we'll, we'll sell you the whole seat, but you'll only need the edge. Uh, but anyway, yeah, we uh, we have that on Saturday. And then is the parade still happening this year? Grand Parade happens every year, um, and it's great. It's not just for the community. It's for anybody that wants to come out. Uh, but we also have a youth parade that happens on Thursday, and we have a youth kickball tournament uh, for K through 6 that happens on Thursday as well. So it's the whole family can it's do things. jam packed over in Harlan, and that's not typically a destination in the area. So why would you suggest people come over to Har Harlan? Well, if they just want to have a laid back, uh, just a family event, and they want to come out and get some food, fair type food, but at a very reasonable price. Uh, then we want them to come out and just have fun with us. They could even take a helicopter ride. Uh, cool. So fee for that as well. They have, you know, that's a, they got to pay for the fuel somehow. Yeah. Uh, but we have again just all types of different events. There's dog show. There's a car show that goes on at four o'clock on Saturday. We have that's a really well uh, attended event as well. And of course, uh, this is a lot of information. So is there somebody so where is somebody can go to to see all of this? There is okay, here. Good. <laughs> you could either go to harlandays.com or you could look at us look us up at uh, 2021 Harland Days Festival on Facebook. Kevin, thank you so much. Harlan Days Festival kicks off on Thursday and ends next Saturday. Of course, it is free like we mentioned. And that website again is harlandays.com.